It's Spider Bite at NextGenTactics.com, and this is District Defense. I like to throw this grenade right here because you will usually catch uh, the opposing team on offense uh, rushing through that alleyway. It's pretty hard on offense um, to do some rushes just because of the frag fest that usually occurs at the beginning of the game. So we know the bomb was down there, and. Uh, if there's anybody left, they'll probably be at the spawn. And that's the thing on this map. Uh, generally, you can sort of corner the offense into their spawn area with all the frags flying around. And especially on uh, A side, where there are just a, a ton of cars on that side. I mean, the car bombs are just ridiculous. So we know a guy went in here. He's just sort of standing there. I mean, I don't even have a silencer on. And no one's really coming after me, so... That's kind of good. And you gotta watch at the end of that alley, because a lot of times... You will see people crouch down beside that uh, little bin. So here's that frag again. You don't catch anybody that time, but we see a guy going around here. <clears throat> so we want to catch him before we progress. It's likely we have a sniper up at A, so we don't have to worry about anybody coming down that way or flanking us. Hopefully. And a couple guys over at B, so I think we've got them fairly well contained. Again, like I said, I think on defense, containment is key. Keep them in their, uh, near their spawn area. So we kind of avoid that guy just because we're at sort of a long range with our, uh, shotgun. Looks like we picked up a nice weapon. And that guy's still back there, so we're gonna make our way back towards the spawn area. See if our teammate can flush him out. There he is. Okay. Now he's got UAV. I don't have jammer. So we're kind of waiting here to see if he pops his head out. Doesn't mean he'll likely come after us. There he is there. So there's a claymore there. We just saw a couple claymores. We're trying to get him to follow us in through the claymores. But he doesn't follow us. Now he still has UAV. Now what I'm going to do here, I'm sort of waiting for him. He's either coming after me or he's going to plan today. I'm pretty sure he's going to plan today. UAV expired, I immediately start running to A because I know he's gone down here to plant. I mean, I can't guarantee it, but I, I'm pretty sure he is. And there he is up top. And we can catch him before he's set. So that's one thing you, you want to try. When they have a UAV, you don't have jammer on. You know, you're heading in one direction. As soon as the UAV ends, immediately go to the other direction because it sort of gives him a false sense of security. He knows he has a certain period of time, and he pro likely thinks he has longer than he does in reality have. Um, so as soon as you change direction, you uh, you can catch him off guard like we did. So this is going to be our metal rush. And I think I said this in my full uh, full district game, that um, if there's a guy at the top of that wall, then he might kill you, or he probably will kill you if he's standing up there. We know there's another guy around here. Our teammate helps us out, fortunately. There's another guy over by A side, or near A, where all the cars in the parking parking lot. I guess we can call it a parking lot back here. And we get the last two. Okay, so here's our grenade toss. I, again, I love tossing this grenade. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> People don't learn not, you know, either you got to rush through that uh, alley very, very quickly or not at all. 
You don't do it half ass because you get killed just like that. So we got our UAVs, four on whatever, I didn't see that. I think we're good. And we're just searching, there's the last guy right there. Never fails right to spawn. I'm gonna go out to do this time. Okay, sorry, another example. Actually, I'm throwing it off the other direction. Um, I do try to switch it up. If you've caught one or two people down that middle alley, then I'll switch it to the other side. Just because they sort of learn after a couple of rounds. Maybe. Now, I ran right by that Claymore. And the guy didn't come after me. I think he's around the corner there. But I'm just going to go up this, uh, this stairway and try and catch him. I'm not sure what he's thinking right now. But he comes up the stairs right behind me. Or right in front of me. I got lucky once. And the bomb is right on the okay. stairs too. Well, I'm gonna watch the back <laughs> in the middle. So they're kind of screwed. Can, can you hold on for a minute? Obviously, we're using our UAV because it's the last round of the game. I'm defending that. Hopefully, that will be considered an effective use of the UAV. <laughs> Okay, there you go, and there's an airstrike. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Oh, Alright, everyone go Hey, here's sort of our um, yeah, yeah, yeah. our initial sort of NGT tactical team uh, defense on district. We were just sort of developing this stuff. And uh, so we're all taking our positions. This is my position here. Defense on B. I uh, set up those claymores. Um, just down the roadway. One thing that would be nice, and hopefully they do it in Modern Warfare 2, like I hate the target indicators, because they get in the way sometimes. I mean, you have a hard time seeing sometimes with those, uh, with those indicators, like defend A, defend B, or defend target, the bomb carrier. So, there should be a way to turn that off. Hopefully that that will be there in Modern Warfare 2, because it does get annoying sometimes. I mean, not often, but yeah, sometimes it doesn't interfere with your vision. So this is actually an example from our uh, that full game we did. I was short one round. And we know there's another guy in the house. We're gonna come around. Play a little cat and mouse here. And catch him. So I think there's uh, one, one guy left. One or two. One, I believe. And he's in the house. Our teammate just got killed in here. Yeah, there's two. Okay, one left. So there's the bomb. That's why they kept going into the house. And we're just waiting for the last guy. Obviously, we're going to save our strike. That's it. Hope you liked uh, District uh, Defense. For more of this kind of stuff, visit www.nextgentactics.com. Spider bite out.